CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers, Tuesday, October 18th, 2022. Life in Genoa is no longer peaceful since Tucker's arrival. Everyone from the Newman family to Abbott has been more or less affected. But that's okay. He alone won't be able to hurt anyone. Nate confesses that he was indifferent to Elena's feelings and love before, but now he wants to change himself. He wants to show everyone how much he loves Elena. But it's too late. She no longer has feelings for Nate. No matter how much she begged, she refused, because she understood that if she went back, she would only suffer again. Lily and Devon support this decision. Nate is no match for anyone. He's alone working and seeing his mistakes to correct. Otherwise, he will never regain anyone's trust. Sometimes when we forgive too easily, it will cause the guilty person to look down on them, which is unacceptable. Adam and Sally no, now no longer have animosity. They reconciled and fixed their relationship as before. Therefore, fans should not expect that Sally will marry Nick again. Adam beat Nick this time, and he deserved it. Sally never saw Nick as a man she could love. She only saw him as a replacement. Ashley and Tucker are reconnecting, and they think they were made for each other. Everything went so smoothly, much to Abby's surprise. They are much more than 10 years apart, and when they meet again, they still love each other. So it can be confirmed that their love is real and very sincere. Summer told Kyle about Dominic's future, and Tara sent a text message that she would return, return to regain custody, should they give up gently so that the boy can live with his biological mother. If they stand up and fight, it will leave a wound in the child's psyche that can never be healed. Summer reveals that she has an opinion like this. She wants to make a deal with Tara that Dominic will live with Tara, but Summer and Kyle are still his parents, and will they visit him often? Would Tara agree? Lily and Devon left their CEO positions at Chancellor Winters and left behind countless disputes. Jill had to go back to deal with it, and she found Victoria, a capable and reputable person in Genoa, to fill the position most convincingly.